Okay, we're back everybody. We got a pretty good amount of snow last night. So, unfortunately I'm gonna go set off all my dirt hole sets and give them a break for a few days. We're supposed to get more snow and uh, they're not gonna work too good when we have 12 inches of snow on them. So, I'm gonna set them off, but we're down here on the creek and I'm walking up to this first set. And it's appears to be still set or no no we got a beaver whoa whoa that just went down but I think we have a beaver in there covered in snow oh yeah Let's pull him up out of here. I'm gonna put this back on my head. Okay, let's see. Wow, that's a big beaver. That is a big beaver there. Yep, that's a big, that's a big beaver. Well, we were fortunate enough to pull a big old beaver out of there. That's a, a real nice fat beaver. What do you think, Scout? What do you think of that beaver? But, uh, that was that set that I pounded in that uh, piece of freshly stew chewed uh, poplar and uh, put it on the other side of the 330. And the uh, there's a big run that was coming up here where these beaver were coming up out and going over in here and chewing. So they were naturally going through here. And it actually looked like I caught this beaver coming back down the run. So he was already up on the bank and came back down and got caught. So pretty awesome. We got another trap over here we gotta check. But first, let's look at that trail camera and see if we got any footage of that catch. I'll show that to you next if we got any. Okay, everybody, we're walking over here and 
We nailed another beaver. You're gonna get really cold, Scout. This is uh, a set that pinches right into the creek here. There's a bunch of brush that got caught up on a treetop right here, and it left this. <laughs> She's gonna be really cold. What are you doing? That wasn't very smart. Anyways, this all pinched down right here and I blocked it off with a bunch of sticks and we nailed another beaver so we doubled up here. That's actually the sixth beaver we've taken out of here now. I'm actually gonna pull these traps out because I'm gonna be busy with work this week and I'm not gonna have enough time to, uh, well, I could check them in the dark but I'd rather check them in daylight. So we'll pull these out of here and we might come back later on and set a few more traps, but we've na we've taken six of them out of here so far. Where's my... Ooh, that's another big one. Oh wow, that's a big one too. Two real big ones. Boy, those are two big beavers we pulled out today. Pulled six of them out now. Let's see if we had any luck on this. Uh, man, the creek is way down. This water was up to here a few days ago when I set that trap. Let's see if this camera captured anything. Well, I'd say we did pretty darn good on our last check here. I'm gonna go ahead and pull these traps for the time being, but we got two really big beavers. We're gonna weigh both of these things and see. <laughs> Scout's going nuts. <laughs> what are you doing? You got briars in your ear. Wow. We'll weigh these when we get back to the house and see what they weigh. Okay, time to make the trek out of here.
Okay, we got these beavers here and we got the scale. We'll zero it out. We're zeroed. Put this on my head and we'll get these things weighed. I'm saying right around 50 pounds. Maybe 48. They're both really big beavers. Got a slip knot on one of these. Looks like this one right here. Yep. First beaver weighs in at looks like 48 pounds. Can't see it very good. 48.5, 48 and a half it weighs in at. Just under 50 pounds. Let's see what this other one's at. Fifty-one point four eight. That one weighs in at. So that's a heck of a big beaver. Fifty. Fifty-one pounds. 